All right, all right. I believe that we are live here. Hey, gang, this is Wesley Anderson coming to you live from Houston, Texas. Hope everybody's having a fantastic day. Feels good to feel good again. Actually, just got done with a really good uh, spin class. You guys know I love doing the Peloton thing. Got some great energy out of it. Was able to do like the actual heart rate interval training, which was really good. So that was exciting to be able to get back and uh, get the mojo going again. So I hope everybody's having a fantastic day. Hey, if you're watching this on a replay, if you'll hit hashtag replay and where you're calling in from, I would love to say hello and, uh, and thank you for calling in. And, uh, and if you get any value out of this video, please like, comment, share. If you think it might help anybody, if you know me, I like uh, helping anybody. It doesn't matter what profession you're in, what company you're in. It doesn't matter. If I can help you, that means I've done something good today. So Jason Regan, what's up, brother, from the UK? Hope you're doing well, buddy. If you guys don't know Jason, check him out. You can see he's in the comments right now. they got floating coaches. They're incredible trainers um, and coaches. So go ahead and check him out. Um, Graham, what's going on, my friend? Tammy, yeah. we're live. You got me live. Thanks for jumping on, my friend. Graham, I hope you're doing well, but yep, feels good to be up and about. So, uh, so guys, I want to go back real quick and recap. My last video was just about um, being about marketing properly, especially on Facebook. Hey, Melissa, good to see you, my friend. Nice to catch you live. Hope you're kicking butt. So if you guys want real estate in Minnesota, hit Melissa up. She's absolutely awesome. So um, hit her up. So guys, so uh, just to recap real quick, it was about marketing on Facebook and making sure, especially for new people, all right, making sure you're not spamming people and pushing your product all over people. It was about becoming a relationship marketer, asking questions, because if you do that and you do that right and you learn how to do it, you'll make more money and you'll be less frustrated. Plus your friends won't run from you every single time you say hello to them. All right, so, so make sure you go back and check that recap out. You guys know that um, if you're building a business, real estate, uh, network marketing, any kind of small business on, uh, and you use Facebook for relationship marketing, did you add your three to five Facebook friends today, okay? Three to five friends today, make sure you don't go to Facebook jail, go back on some videos, I can show you how to do that. Did you add any value today to, for anybody? And again, something I want everybody practicing all the time, okay, all the time is, uh, I just lost my train of thought, is referring people to uh, their businesses, even without getting referrals back. Always searching to help and refer people. Exactly like Melissa said about the relationship. Ask questions and be genuine. People love that and they're okay with that and they wanna help you when you do that, okay? So guys, those are the recaps. Today is really simple and I hope this will help some people. It's just something I picked up recently and it's just a Facebook tip on how to, uh, to be a little more efficient with your Facebook time and more productive, all right? Because we all know that Facebook can be the biggest time waster in the entire world. It happens to all of us. All of a sudden, we're searching the feed and looking and looking and looking, and it's an hour, two hours, and you're like, holy cow, I didn't do anything, okay? So um, I want you guys to go ahead and learn about how to use Facebook friends lists, okay? Now, this is a little bit different than the groups. Do not, if you're adding people to groups, this is a, that's a totally different subject without asking them, stop doing that, nobody likes that. I, I would delete people when I do that, okay? Hey, Tim, good to see you, buddy. Day Vibes, good to see you, my friend. Appreciate you, appreciate you. So guys, how to use Facebook friends list. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to your home button, hit home, okay? That's gonna take you to your wall, okay? Then you gotta make sure I'm, I'm telling you exactly right how to do this, okay? Then what you do, where is it? I, I closed the wrong thing. So if you look at the left bar on your home, it says explore, okay? Under that tab, there's a bunch of different things. One of them is friends lists. All right, so go ahead and click on that. And then it's gonna give you an option to create this list. Now again, this isn't like creating a group. Creating a list is solely for you, okay? It's not adding people to a group. So what I would recommend is everybody have three, four, five different lists. The first one's gonna be your influencers, okay? And these are the top five to 15 influencers that you know, that you know when you go read their posts, whether it's a blog, a video, um, one of those things, you get ultimate value out of it. There's someone you learn from all the time. Everybody should have an influencer list, okay? Like Dave Ives, I have him on my influencer list. He's got great videos. I know that if I go click on that list, what happens is, is it shows my top, my 10 that I have on my influencer list, and it just shows their feed, okay? It doesn't show everybody else. It, no, that way I can go and I say, hey, I need to spend 10 minutes on my influencer feed. So I go hit that, it just shows the influencers, all right? If you're uh, building a business and you have a prospect list, you might have a prospect list right there. 
Okay, the next thing might be your team members if you have a team. Okay, if you're even real estate, you're a broker, your team members, you want to go check and see what they're up to. And it's just compartmentalizing and becoming efficient. Okay, whatever it is, it might be, you might do referrals. Okay, it might be some of the people that have given you referrals or people that you want to give a referral. You go and look and see what they posted that day. So it's just really about being able to check those lists and, and how they're specifically designed for that. Now, I still like having random where I can go look at the wall and there's anything goes. But when I know that I need to be more efficient in business and I go, hey, I need 10 minutes, I can go check. I need to go check my influencers. I haven't checked today. I need to go check my team members. I need to go check this. So, guys, that'll just help you kind of be a little more efficient and not waste so much time on Facebook. We all love Facebook. I love the value it brings. I love being able to say everybody. I, I'm, I'm always going to keep it open for my friends to see softball and baseball and that kind of stuff. But in terms of building business, all right, you want to start working on these lists. That way you can be more efficient. So I hope that helps you guys. I just wanted to give you a quick tip that I've been working on. It's, it works well for me. I enjoy it. And again, it doesn't matter what company you're with. Um, it, it doesn't matter what profession. If I can help you, I love to. If you get any value on this, please like, share, comment. Love helping you guys out. Hey, Mia, good to see you, my friend. You rock. Hope you're doing well. So with that being said, guys, I'm excited to be back, excited to have energy. We'll be coming back here to you live a little more often from Houston, Texas. You guys have a fantastic day. We'll see you guys soon.